He doesn't need any legs, he can fly. He has to be next to us while we cry and scream. We're always like, oh my god, fruit, stop screaming at me. And it's like a little tiny meow. Hey, fruit. Baby fruit. He's like so fat. Why is your belly so big? Ah, ah, ah! She just has to be the center of attention. After like a couple of days of having him, when we were watching him walk, we were like, is he just wobbly because he's a kitten, or is he wobbly because he can't walk? And he was just peeing on himself. So we started making the little diaper holders. Hey, Fruit. Move your legs. So then we kept watching him, kept watching him. And I was like, I think something's wrong with him. But his x ray looks like a normal kitten. They're like, well, we don't understand like why he can't walk. He just kept getting babies, no definite diagnosis. And he was doing really well, so we thought uh, maybe he could walk. One day, he got really, really sick. In my head, he was going to make it. He walked all this way. He literally like, shriveled. Just hearing all the vets telling me to put him down. And I just like, saw him every day just being so pimped. I had to do something. We could be an awesome incubator. He had the virus to run his course. So we would visit him every night. And we were both like, all right, well, we'll give him a day or two just to see if there's any improvement. So we got him the special food within like a day or two. Like he had like dog poops again. Wow, like he really wants to be alive. He is my inspiration. Now he's thriving. I just feel like he's different. Like he really wants to walk. I was working him at home at hours at night. Like, my lap and I'm just messing with him. Like, oh, now he's doing therapy. You standing all by yourself? Did you do it for therapy? And now you can stand? He's like, I can sure stand. <laughs> Hi, Fruit. Hi, Fruit. Hi, Fruit. Hi, Fruit. Hi, Fruit. He's just drives to just be alive. He still had so much personality and fun to just live life. Come on. You can do it. Yay! He loves us. He'll sleep with us in bed. He's just so cuddly, and he just like has to be with us at all times. <laughs> he should be almost a full-grown cat at this point, but he's two and a half, three pounds. He's like a permanent kitten, so it's even cuter. We put so much time and effort, love into him. Root for fruit.